Hey folks, this is uh, my uh, uh, unboxing of the Belkin USB 3.0 uh, dual video docking stand for Windows 8 tablets. Uh, just I'll just do an unboxing of it and kind of show you what's in it and all the kind of things that you're getting with it. Um, I'll just I'll open up and show you. Uh, this is actually going to be one of my uh, first unboxings uh, on my channel, like so. Hopefully it goes quite well. I'm just. Uh, open up this box just just so you can see kind of what's in it. it comes I got this from Amazon and it's basically just basically just a cardboard box with the Belkin name on the top and you know what you're getting with it on here and um, I'm assuming it comes with like normal kind of advertised kind of packaging on it when you get it. this is basically the manual that it comes with that's on top of the box open up this just unclose that basically comes with the charger just a normal kind of charger that'll plug into the back of the the Belkin unit itself, and it comes with adapter. So I'm assuming if you're uh, if you're in America, it'll come with obviously an, an American adapter with it. Uh, yeah, well here's a European plug for this one, and a normal uh, UK mains plug as well in there. Put that to one side. Uh, this will be the this will be the USB downstream uh, the USB three. Uh, that you put on to the actual uh, tablet, you'll connect this end to the tablet and that'll connect on to the docking station itself. Oh, and it actually comes with, yeah, VGA to DVI. Yeah, it comes with a VGA to DVI uh, adapter, so you can connect that up to the DVI port that's on the back of the, the actual Belkin uh, docking station itself. Now, there's also a display port on it as well that it comes with it. You can, so if you've got a second one, I don't think there's anything in here, is it? I'll open this up just in case, like. Let's see if I can get it open. No, nothing in there. Right. Um, well, right here it is. I'll get this box out of the way. So we have that there. Like this, so. It's actually quite a. Uh, Quite heavy kind of weighted unit actually to be honest with you it's quite it's got quite a fair weight to it but that's kind of what you want really if you're going to be using it you know for your tablet or whatever I'll actually put the tablet on it just so you can kind of see what it looks like with it on it and actually fits it quite well I mean can you still touch the yeah, you can still touch the windows button so no I can't see any issues it's not like it you know you can't touch the window windows button or anything with it so you know, that's, that's, that's a bit of a bonus really, you know, it's, it's not like it's kind of conflicting with anything, it kind of, it actually sits quite well, I mean, it's got, like, there's a bit of a gap at the side of it where the, where it sits at, you can just see there where it sits, so it's, you know, it does sit on it quite well. I'll take the tablet off just to, so I can show you more about it. Right, it basically comes with this kind of bit at the back where you can put the cable, so if I've got the this USB 3, I'll just have to undo this, in the back of the actual docking station itself, connect that onto there, and then all you have to do is basically put your tablet on it and connect it up to whatever the USB port is on your uh, Surface, so or whatever Windows 8 tablets you're using it for, because you can use it for uh, basically any Windows 8 tablet. But uh, I've actually I've actually been reading up a few of the reviews of this. Uh, before I got it, and supposedly it doesn't actually work with Windows 8, it only works with Windows 8.1. I'm um, assuming that's more of a driver issue than anything else. But um, it comes, uh, you, you basically you can connect it up, so that's it connected up just now. I'd have to power it up for it to fully be sorted, like, but I'll leave that till later. I'll be doing a, another video to actually show, uh, I'll be showing like uh, the, the monitors, uh, I'll actually have dual monitors connected up to it, so it'll basically have the surface and two monitors connected up uh, to show how that how well that works and you know showing it like I'll have like all my kind of peripherals and sides of it and all that kind of stuff to show how well that that, that kind of sits on it as well. well I'll disconnect this right so on the side of it as you can see there's two USB 3 ports one of them is a 2.1 amp port for you can charge your phone or like an iPad or whatever and there's a headphone and a mic jack on the side of it as well on the back there's a little place you can kind of put a lock so you can lock it to your desk if you're using it at your work desk at your work and you kind of want to leave it there overnight. Uh, you've got a 5 volt 4 amp uh, connection so that will connect up to your 
adapter and then that will connect up to your mains. Uh, as I said before there's a USB 3 downstream, uh, the DVI-I connector, uh, that's a dual link. Uh, there's the display port connector as well so you can connect up another monitor. There's an RG45 uh, connection port and two USB 2 ports and that's basically all you get with it. That's all the ports you get with it. It'll basically turn your Windows 8 tablet into more, more of a desktop because you can get more peripherals with it and all that kind of stuff. But um, that's, that's basically all I can really say about it really. But, uh, apart from the, the four USB ports, the cable clutter, I quite like the, the kind of, there's like a little kind of bits at the back to connect cables up to. So you can, if you know, you've got the USB downstream cable there, you can wire it round to the side so it kind of, kind of, Gets rid of a bit of clutter, really, when you're whenever you're using it. It's actually quite a weighty thing, so it's you know it's it actually looks really quite well made. It's got a nice kind of matte finish to it, which kind of complements the surface quite well, because it's got like the magnesium uh, alloy that it's got on it. Then it man, it it complement is uh, complements it quite well. Actually, it looks quite nice with it. Anyway, uh, apart from that, I'll just I'll be doing a review. Uh, all the kind of stuff that you can connect up to and actual review a test and out what it looks like and how it actually works and if it's actually worth purchasing because uh, it could cost, I think it cost me about £166 off of Amazon and that uh, that doesn't include posting and packaging so it's it's quite uh, it's quite an expensive you know docking station really I mean if it doesn't work properly it's it's, a, it's an expensive USB hub really uh, because it doesn't work with Windows 8 or RT uh, which I'm assuming is a driver issue more than anything else but, um, I'll, I'll actually try and kind of test that out. But, um, anyway, guys, just like I say, if you did enjoy this video, if you could please like and subscribe, it'd be much appreciated. Anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching.